Here we are back at Day Our Survival. I'm just outside of Priozersk. Okay, all I'm gonna do right now is scavenge. I have myself in a good position where I've recently saved with all my levels be pretty much nearly at zero. So I'm gonna go ahead and, oops, actually I'm gonna make myself a torch. And now I'm gonna go into the town and try and scavenge for some bicycle parts. So I'm gonna see a cafe here. Cafes are really good for items that contain caffeine. Again, you already know I like the tea, the coffee, and the Pepsi. As you travel long distances, that actually lowers your fatigue level as well. So I'm gonna pick up all these items here. And I'm gonna mark it off on my map. So what I'm really looking for are bicycle parts. So I'm gonna be looking for houses and areas like this that have vehicles. So I'm gonna scavenge this house here. I see I'm gonna find some food items here. So we'll pick that up. I like the salt. And we'll mark that off the map. Let's see if this has dirty water and if it does, I can mark it. It does. I'm gonna mark it up with this guy. And maybe while I'm here, whoops, I hit the hunt button, but that's okay. I'm gonna escape that, nice. So we'll search for a few bottles of water that we can take with us and boil and use it for the tea and the coffees we've just found. There's no such thing as too much water. Okay, actually let's hit up this one first. House, it doesn't really need, have much that I need. The only thing that I would want here really is the salt. And since I didn't take much, I might not mark that one off on the map for me. So this one doesn't have the parts I need. Let's try this area here with another vehicle. No, but you see there's a mystery coupon in some places you search. These are good to get. I even found one that was an a for the AK-47. And actually it just so happened to be that I got that coupon just after I bought it at full price, which really sucks, but whatever. It is what it is, and that's what it was. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up maybe a few items here because maybe I'll need them down the road. Threads are good for fixing your clothing items. That's pretty much all I need there. And I'm gonna get out of this place. My radiation level is past 30. So definitely need to lower that guy. So I'll go back here to my camp. I will eat a few things here, have a drink and take a break. You'll see that as we go to when we travel, the farther we travel, the more items we keep unlocking. So that's just how it is. We're increasing all of our skills as much as we can. So pretty much I'm just gonna sleep right now. I'd like to try to drop my radiation and poisoning level, but I'm just gonna let that naturally happen. I'm gonna pick up all of my items here. I'm actually gonna kindle this fire and boil my water. That boiling button is getting faster and faster and eventually it won't even show up anymore. Okay, I'm gonna make my coffee up. And I have some tea here I'm gonna make up. Especially if we're traveling long distances, you already know the caffeine helps your fatigue. Okay, so that's pretty much all my stuff. I have everything. Have another drink, eat a little bit of food, get my stats pretty much right to zero. And then I'll continue traveling. I think I'm gonna go over here to this city, Kalevala, Kalevala. And I'm gonna start to scavenge Kalevala. 
And then I'll keep making my way from there down to about this area. In that area, there is another quest in a submarine. I like to get that trophy before I move on. So I think I'm gonna stop it now, maybe after this. I guess I can escape it. I really only fight when I have to. I'm a lover, not a fighter. So maybe I'll make camp here for right now. Actually, you know what, I really don't need to make camp. All I really need to do is make a torch. Chop up some wood. Go to design, make my torch. So I'm not stumbling around in the dark. Again, if you're stumbling around in the dark, you risk dislocating some sort of your body. And if you do have a vehicle, you're not able to use it. And that also sucks. And it takes quite a bit. Eventually you'll be able to sew it up and then cauterize it if you have to, but right now you can't. You have to literally just hang around until it heals for like five days. So what I'm gonna do is make camp outside of this city. What I'm gonna do is scavenge this city and then I'll come back.